Hello, today we are going to learn how to draw a regular pentagon given the measurement of one of its sides, the line segment L. In this case, it's going to be 7 centimeters, as can be seen here on the top left hand side of the screen. So the first thing we need to do is to draw a horizontal straight line at the bottom of the screen. And on the left side of this line, we will mark a point A. So now, setting the compass to the given length L of 7 cm, which is the side of the pentagon that we want to draw, we are going to transport this onto the horizontal line, starting from point A and getting a new point B, as can be seen here. And the line segment AB will be the first side or the base of the regular pentagon that we want to draw. Now we need to draw the perpendicular bisector of the line segment AB. To do this, I remind you, we must draw two arcs with the same radius. The radii must be longer than half of the base of the line segment AB. So setting our compass to slightly more than half of the line segment AB and setting our compass on point B, we scribe an arc above and below the line. And now with the same radius, setting the compass on A, we scribe two more arcs intersecting the previously drawn arcs. This arc will cut the first arc in two points as shown here in the video. The perpendicular bisector is the line which passes through these two intersections. This perpendicular bisector passes through the base AB at a point, the midpoint, which we will call M. Okay, so now let's draw a perpendicular line starting from point B using our set squares. This line must be longer than the line segment AB. So now, setting the compass on point B and with a radius of AB, we are going to scribe an arc to the right until it cuts the vertical line at a new point, which we will call point P. So the next step is centering our compass on the midpoint M and with a radius MP, we are going to scribe an arc to the right until it intersects the prolongation of the line segment AB, as can be seen here in the video. And we will obtain a new point, which we will call point Q. So the length AQ will be equal to the diagonal length of the pentagon that we want to draw. So now we have all the measurements necessary to draw the pentagon. We will continue setting the compass to the length AQ and centering it on point B and we scribe an arc to the right as shown here. And now setting the compass on point A and with the same radius we scribe another arc to the left intersecting our previously drawn arc. These two arcs intersect at a point which will be the highest vertex of the regular pentagon that we are looking for. So now we must locate the other two vertices of the pentagon. To do this, setting the compass to the length of the radius AB and centering it on point B, we will scribe an arc to the right until it cuts the previously drawn arc as shown here. And again, with the same radius and centering the compass on point A, we scribe an arc to the left until it cuts the previously drawn arc at a new point. So now we will call these three points uh, C, D and E respectively. 
So now that we have located our five vertices, A, B, C, D, and E, the final step is in a thicker line, A, connect the five vertices. So starting at point E, we'll join it to vertex D in a thicker line. And now we'll join vertex D to vertex C. Vertex E to vertex A. Vertex C to vertex B. And finally the base of our pentagon, vertex A to vertex B. So now we have our complete pentagon, regular pentagon. So I hope this video has helped you. Please press like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Until the next video, thank you very much.